It's time for another reading in the collaboration between Carl M. Jenks Poetry Corner and Bespoke Vocals. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, or whatever it is you do wherever you watch these little ditties. And also please sign up for Carl's weekly essay letter on poetry. After the video, of course. Thank you. <laughs> Tonight he's asked me to read. The Thermopolium by Dorian Locks. Ancient snack stall uncovered in Pompeii. The Daily Star. Even in 79 AD, people loved street food. All the young Romans flocking around the sizzling terracotta pots. The stalls frescoed with chickens and hanging ducks. Hot drinks served in ceramic two-handled pateras filled with warm wine and spices. Their sandaled feet glimmered as they milled around, waving hellos, smudging one another's cheeks with kisses, murmuring gossip, complaining about the crazy rise in the price of wheat. Soups and stews. Skewered meats, snacks of flat bread, honey cakes, and candy made with figs. They sprawled on the steps or sat near a neighbor's open door, stood under a blur of windows, someone playing a lyre, barefoot children singing the ode of Horace. Just like New York before the pandemic, before the many retreated and retired to their living rooms, to watch the news on a loop, alone with the cat or dog, a furry stay against the nothing, nothing, nothing of loneliness, their dreams a passport to fear. I used to see the excavated people of Pompeii, frozen in time, caught curled in sleep or kneeling, a couple fucking, though there is one of a possible father, propped in what looks like an easy chair, a mother bouncing a child on her lap. As if they've decided in their final moments to be happy, to go into the afterlife covered in ash, buried alive by joy. The Thermopolium by Dorian Locks. Thank you, Carl, for this lovely piece. Please remember to use the links to assist the ongoing humanitarian efforts in Ukraine or anywhere else in the world. The world needs a big hug from all of us. Spread light, please. Give me a like, a share, a subscribe if you wish, and I will see you soon.